75 Part A Dad's Transformation Hi everyone, welcome to day 37 of my 75 hard journey. Thank you for tuning in. Saturday morning, finally the weekend is coming in and we had the chance to sleep in since there was not much going on in the morning, but my mind decided that 6.30 is a good time to wake up and wasn't able to get back to sleep, so I got up and went out really quick to pick up breakfast for my family and I had plans for Saturday morning and lunchtime because there is a, um, I would think, quarterly or yeah, quarterly flea market in the kindergarten of my son and as my mom, who is involved in this kindergarten still, even when she was retired, um, bullied me to say, hey, you never show up, you don't invest time, you don't do like work for this kindergarten, Could you, I, you need to get more involved. I signed up to sell coffee and cake, all shifts. So I had to be there at 11 till 3. And I spent my whole Saturday morning slash day in my son's kindergarten. But it was fun. Interestingly, again... I was more likely the only dad who showed up at that event. So obviously there were dads and moms who were looking for clothes and toys and bought cake and coffee. But from a parenting side, from the kindergarten, I was, I feel like the only dad who showed up and supported that project. But as the person as I am, I, I don't hold back. So I made fun of people and we made jokes and um, I talked the kid to the kids I normally talked at some point a mom said if my dad would have talked to me in that tone and this kind of sarcasm I potentially would have been crying under the kitchen table all the time <laughs> that was funny to me yeah but I feel like it was pretty nice and I was holding back and I was I just from time to time I just we was honest to people so um, when this was done, um, and it was around three, I went home, brought some cake for the rest of the family so they can enjoy it because there was some, so much leftovers. Um, one of my best friends came over and he's also the godfather of my youngest son. And he visited us for the rest of the day and he played with the kids and um, my wife was then being able to work upstairs in the office. And I took the chance to go out to put my uh, first workout in, which was uh, a walk with the dogs. So pretty late in the afternoon, it was already like four. Um, but since he was there and my kids occupied him, there was not much kind of time to, to chat anyways. So I went for the walk. When I went back, we made pizza together, vegan pizza, obviously, and a little bit of meat for the kids because they like it very much. We just sat down then after after dinner. So all kids, the, the godfather and I, played some Mario Party and enjoyed ourselves. I would say till 9.30, then it was time to go to bed for the kids. We sit down for a good hour, but then um, it got time to break it off. Um, he went to bed and I jumped on the rowing machine and rowed for the 45 minutes. Yeah, so you see, today, even when was the, where there was much going on with all the flea market stuff, um, I, I'm going to keep the episode short today because there is not much else to talk about. So let's go through that list. First workout was the walk with the dogs in the pouring rain, rain by the way, it poured, it really poured. And um, that's now starts since autumn is coming in. Um, it's going to get more interesting with the outdoor workouts because um, it's definitely more rainy here in the north. 
So yeah, the second workout was a rowing session. Um, I didn't cheat on my diet. I didn't have any cheat meals at all, no alcohol. Um, I took a picture and I read the 10 pages in the morning because I had the insomnia. So I took the chance to read the few pages. So guys, keep it short today. Thank you for tuning in. Looking forward to the next episode. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.